Welcome back, my faithful viewers, and welcome to another video. So, to all my long timers that's been here a minute, they're back. Yes. The prices start dropping, so why not? And my newbies, well, the ones that are not used to this, I used to order monthly subscriptions to snacks, and we would try them here. Uh, due to the fact that I can't travel around the world yet, so I brought the snacks to me, <laughs> which is really cool. Anyway, today we are starting with Universal Yum. I never had Universal Yum. I had other snack packs. I even had, um, uh, what was it? Uh, not Tokyo Treats, the other one. Anyway, they start getting ridiculous in their pricing. And it would take them so long to get here that by the time I would unbox it, it'd be the next month. Which, no, you know. If you're going to buy a March subscription box, you would like it in the month of March. And I don't want to open a March subscription box in April. Anyway. We are going to travel the world. And ooh, today we are going to Ukraine. So, oh, okay. Oh, this is way different. All right, so over here, I see they got some famous places. Uh, the city, the capital is Kiev. Uh, let's see. Home of... Plasanka Museum, Odessa, ah, okay, oh, there's Crimea, and there's, uh, I think that's a pie, I'm not sure, <laughs> so here are all the snacks we're going to get, and you get to write them, I guess you could talk about them, and do your review, ah, the Yum Scoreboard, if I take a if I take my time and actually read. <laughs> okay. We're not going to do that because over here we do our own thing. Okay. Did you enjoy your trip to the Ukraine this month? Oh, way to go. So here we go. Notes for adults. The trivia train. Oh, that's so cute. You get questions and answers. So you actually learn oh this is so oh and that's cute they tell you a little bit about each snack oh that pie over there looks familiar <laughs> okay so oh wow you got a lot of stuff in here come on oh wow and they give you recipes on what to make that is really nice. Oh, look at that. You get to paint your own Easter eggs. And here's your nutritional value for each item that you're going to be eating. Now, I don't know if you know, but these, um, that plate of eggs right there, they're not hard-boiled. I know about this one. Uh, what they do, this is the art in Ukraine. Oh, let me get this back. Let me show you. Uh, it's an art in Ukraine that you get a raw egg. You make a hole in the bottom, a hole in the top. You blow out the egg. That is a hollow shell. And you paint. And you dip. And it's waxing, and each time you dip into wax, it's a different color. And um, the way they do it is they rub off the egg, the excess. It's something they do is they rub it this black ink off, and as they rub off the black ink, it exposes this, those colors. You ever try rubbing on an eggshell and not cracking it? Oh, yeah. That's why it's an art form. And here's some stickers. So those of you that are into stickers, you got some stickers, you got some interesting stuff. 
And that's, and we just gotten into the food. So you'll get to learn all this stuff before you even get to the food. And a rye wheat bread chip. Okay. And that is so cute. It's in a little bag that you would get here in the States. Oh, that is adorable. Oh my God, I'm gonna try not to rip it too badly. I really wanna save this, this is so cute. Okay, come on you. Come on. Oh, I ripped it. Oh. Okay, come on. Come on. Oh, are we gonna come up? Yes, yes, yes. Look at that, we did it, we did it. Oh, that is adorable, isn't that cute? Oh. Oh my God, that is so adorable. That's so adorable, it's the cute little slices of bread. Okay, so there's the scissors. I think I'm gonna keep these handy. Okay. And we're gonna get a little piece. We're just gonna get a little piece. Just to get a taste. Oh, that's good. Mmm. That might taste a little soft. Onion. A touch of garlic. Hmm. So you slice the bread, you fry it in oil, sprinkle with spices. Hmm. Oh yeah, these are good. These are real good. Hmm. I would see that with cream cheese on it. <laughs> Take a little bit of cream cheese on there. <laughs> mm. Oh, you can sprinkle it on your soup, on your salad. Oh my God, here's the ingredients. It has salt, garlic, dried tomatoes, and paprika. This is really good. I like this, I'm happy with this. Mm. Mm, mm. Okay. Ah, uh, this is so cute. Little jelly rolls. Okay. Let's see what's in here. Okay, there is no way you can save this bag. So we're just gonna cut it along the top to get in there. Mmm. Oh, you don't smell. Oh my God. I want to get this out. Oh my God. First off, let me tell you, you could smell the fruit in this thing. Mmm, you don't get that from American food. As a shape of a cherry. This is a watermelon piece. What is this? Oh, it's a pear. It's in the shape of a pear. And that's in the shape of a strawberry. Oh, and that's a peach. The peachy. I got you one. <laughs> oh my God, and green apple. Is in the shape of a green apple. Oh my God. I'm gonna get a watermelon because I'm gonna be honest, my most favorite fruit is a watermelon. Oh my God, that is good. Mmm, 25% fruit juice, it tastes it. Oh my God, you smell it. Mm. Oh my God. Mmm. 
These aren't gummies. I mean, no. The jellies. This is what's called a jelly. These are delicious. And I wish we had them here. But these are really good. I'm not going to play with you right now. Because I could tell it's going to be hard to get it back in the packaging. I may just put that in a in a ziplock. Okay. It's a tart made with currant. Now, if you don't know what a currant is, it's a berry. It's a teeny tiny berry that comes off of a tree. Yeah, I know. You think it'd be a cherry, but it has, unlike a cherry, a cherry has a, a pit. But with these, oh, oh, that's so good. Look at that. Oh, and they really took care of this. They took, that was very, I'm just going to pick it up and bite into it. I'm just going to do it. These are so, can I break it? Can I break it? Yeah. Oh. Oh. Mmm. Oh, I love current. I actually went on a, hold on, I need a taste of this. I know what we're getting into. Mmm. 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 I need a coffee with that one. I can't, I can't, I got all that. Oh my God. Currants are delicious. It is very mild, very sweet. Not a little tart. It's a little tart. Um, I'm putting it over there because I'm going to eat that later. I ain't going to lie. This is over. That's gone. Oh my God. But I had ordered, I went to um, Amazon UK. And I ordered a jar of currant from England, and it was so good. I used it sparingly on toast, and I only, I used like toast or something because it was so good. I didn't want nothing else to interfere with the flavor of the jelly itself. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, I'm, I'm finishing the rest of the currant. If you ever have a chance to eat currant, you got to try it. All right, so condensed milk sponge bread. I'm having a feeling this is like uh, the Spanish bread. Um, uh, de leche, dulce, de leche, something like that. Don't, don't, don't come after me. I, ooh. Oh, it has cream inside. <laughs> Look at that. Can you see that? Oh, can you see it? <laughs> okay. I just want a little piece. Just a little bit. A little bit. Oh. 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 Okay. Not what I expected. It is a drier cake and not moist like the Dulce de Leche cake. It is a drier cake. Very light, very spongy. It needed that cream. If you did not have that cream on that cake, that would not have been enjoyable. That is definitely a cake you want to drink, that you want something to drink with. Uh, whether it's tea, coffee, milk. <laughs> you, you don't want to eat that by itself. Oh, I know what these are. Oh, remember these. These are so hard to transfer because they break easily. 
Let me see what they do in the Ukraine. Some of them are broken, but this is the average size. Some of them are <laughs> got a little broken. We're gonna eat the little one. I mean, I got a lot more in here. Oh God. Mmm. So light, so airy, so delicate, yet crispy, crunchy. A little hint of lemon from the cookies and cream. Oh my god. That would make a coffee break or tea time. That would just take it to the next level. Ukraine. Oh my god, that was amazing. Amazing. Okay. This, this is an almond chocolate coated wafer bar, but instead of with peanut butter, it has an almond in it. Okay. Oh, this is pretty. Let me go ahead and show you this. Oh my God, that, see, now this. This is a candy bar. This is what they have, a candy bar. <laughs> this is a Ukrainian candy bar. Mm. 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 Mm -hmm. You see all them pieces? You see all them pieces? Oh my God. Mmm. Universal yums. Oh, oh dear God. You found some good stuff over here. Okay. We have a big yum. This is my surprise. I don't know what the surprise is, but they gave me a surprise. Surprise, surprise, surprise. <laughs> Okay. Okay, so basically it's a bag of mixed taffies. That's uh, strawberry and blueberry. So this is a bunch of mixed taffies. They all look like that. Uh, the color, the little monsters change with the fruit. So they got green apple. Oh, there's a heart candy too. This is a lemon candy. You don't see lemon candies. Hardly ever do you see lemon candies. Oh my God. So, okay, so basically, hold on. I got another one. Oh, there you go. So this here, oh, that's going to be delicious. I'm not going to eat these on here due to the fact that it would take me forever to eat a taffy and we don't have that much time so we got three more items left this is a coco shucky so it looks like cookies and cream but in a you know i gotta try it we gotta take it out we gotta see what it is. Okay, so. Okay, so it is little sections. You got four sections. So let's just take that one. Okay. Mm. 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 Okay. Okay, it's a little different. Okay, so it is a wafer, it's a wafer shell, but it's 
filled with the uh, bits of cookies and cream. And the whole thing is coated with chocolate. Mm-hmm. Okay. Potato snacks wasabi? They have this in the Ukraine? No. We're gonna find out. Come on, guys. Let's find out. Okay. Right. Did I like me with some wasabi now? Hmm. You can smell a hint of wasabi. A hint. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> Ukraine. Oh. Oh. I can't put that back. That's, this is why you take a little piece. Oh. Oh. Oh, that packs a punch. putting it back. I ain't saying shit. That thing put me in my place. I ain't saying shit about shit. I'm putting it away. I ain't fucking with it. You ain't fucking with it. I don't advise you fuck with it. That's some strong shit right there. I'll be eating it later. <laughs> okay. I have no idea what that means. Bubble caramel? Now, I love me some caramel, caramel. Pick one, I don't care. Both delicious. Okay. Ooh, ooh. So it's broken. It's broken in half. There's a bottom half down here. There's an upper half up there. Oh, okay. If you don't like holes. Look away. I will tell you when I'm done. Okay. Look away. I'm showing it now. Can you see how wonderful? That's what it means by bubbles. Let me see. Let me turn it off. Oh, you see it better that way. Okay. Those who have stopped looking, I've stopped showing it. So, let me go ahead. Don't worry, I have issues with holes depending on. So I understand. Oh. Oh, that's good. Mm hmm. That's good. That's good. Mm hmm. You're talking a white chocolate blend. It feels like white chocolate, but what it, let me, let me read this right. It looks like whipped caramel. Yeah. So basically, they whip it until it's nice and bubbly like that, and then they set it. Oh my God, I need another bite. Oh my God, that is so good. Mmm. Mmm. I need to put you here. Mmm. I'm gonna put you there. So, review. Red. Delicious. Um, put some, put some, um, cream cheese with it. Mixed candy. That's going to be good 
not gonna eat it in front of y'all. You know what jellies taste like, they're delicious. If you don't put these with some kind of coffee or tea, we can't be friends. And there's just, there's no compromise. Okay. Sponge cake, a little bit of a letdown. I wish the cake had more flavor. But it would still go good with some coffee. This makes an awesome dessert. These people know how to make a candy bar. Oh my God. Um, let's see. This, great dessert, great candy, great treat. I'll put this back in the bag when we're done. That is an awesome treat. Great jelly, great combination. You could really taste the fruit. This, that, that was a kick in the yes. That was a kick in the yes. My yes still hurts. <laughs> and this is my current tart. Uh, I'm going to eat that later as soon as we're gone. It's gone. Don't worry. Put you over there. Um, I'm going to put you back in here. Now I'm going to, of course, to let you know, Everything is going to be wrapped in a Ziploc, if I can, or, you know, it's going to be all packed away and nice and yummy. But all this, we went to Ukraine. We tasted all these snacks. It's about 15 to 18 snacks in a box. I paid like $20, $30 with shipping. And I don't know, I thought it was worth it. I think it's worth it. I loved it. I hope you loved it. If you like shenanigans like this, you let me know and I'll do it again. Um, I'm hoping to change the direction of the channel. I want to do something new. I want to do something that people are not normally doing. So if you like me doing these unboxings or snack box review, you let me know. I'll keep doing it. Forgot the stickers. Forgot the recipe books and the instruction. That's the game book, activity book. I don't know. And there's a scorecard, and there's all the places that we went to. So, again, if you like this Miss Shenanigans, let me know, and I'll do another treat box. If you prefer I didn't, let me know that too. Not a problem. Uh, until t next time, guys, we're going to hope for the best. We're going to prepare for the worst. By guarantee you kids, we're all going to end up somewhere in the middle. Till next time, bye! <laughs>